If you're interested in doing affiliate marketing to make money online, then you owe it to yourself to watch this episode because there's some truths that other experts and coaches do not share with you about affiliate marketing and how over the years it has become less and less effective. Here's what I mean. When I started my online business way back in 2008, I was only doing affiliate marketing and I was pretty successful at it as well. I was making enough income to replace my day job's income and a little bit more as well just by promoting other people's offers for a commission and that commission I would take home and spend that however I like. But I noticed over the years that my net profit, not just how much I earned in commissions, but my net profit that I take home was decreasing sharply, okay? And this is due to many factors which I'll get into in a second, but one of them was the increase in traffic costs and the increased competition and more people's awareness of how affiliate marketing works in the real world and so on and so on. Now I actually have a little treat for you today because I'm gonna give you access to the exact same module taken from inside our Inner Circle coaching program, which is our high level coaching program to take you from zero to making your first $10,000 plus online with an online business. And you're gonna get that right here in this episode for free, okay? In this episode, I'm gonna be sharing with you specifically the truths of affiliate marketing and why it is not such a good idea in today's economy. Let's go. Now in this section of the program, we're entering stage two, which is all about creation, so you have something to sell. So in this specific video, we're gonna be talking about creating your own products. And right now you may have some misconceptions, so let's go through those right now. Because many people think it's difficult or time consuming to create your own products. But it's actually quick and easy for anybody to create their own best seller. No matter what your circumstances are, no matter how much money you have, or don't have or no matter what your intelligence, your experience, whatever else, it doesn't matter. Anybody can create their own best selling product and even use other people's products and rebrand them as your own, which we'll talk about shortly. So you can often do this in under two weeks, even while working a full time job. I've had clients before who've managed to create their own product in just a matter of days, whereas most people think it takes months or whatever else to get things finished. The reality is when you do this correctly, it should only take you a few days. And that's even working a full-time job. And also you don't even need to create them yourself. We've provided a ton of private label rights products inside this Inner Circle program. So you can simply stamp your name on these products and sell them as your own. Pretty cool, right? So that'll save you a bunch of time, effort, and more. Now, if you look at all of the successful online business owners, how many of them are just affiliates? Think of it this way, all of the experts you know, how many of them are just affiliates? Well, nearly all of them have their own product. So here's exactly why this is the case. Here's why selling your own products beats being an affiliate. One, you are in control of the entire sales process. For example, what the sales copy says, the price of the product, the branding, upsell and downsell process, and a whole lot more. Because when you're selling your own stuff, it's yours. You are in complete control over everything you can possibly think of, which means you can ensure that the product is of good quality. You can ensure that the sales copy isn't overly hypey or going with an angle that you don't necessarily agree with and similar to the actual product itself you can make sure that the stuff being taught inside the product is what you want to teach people and what you believe in whereas with an affiliate offer it's kind of like you get what you get and that's it right so that way you can actually make things yours instead of somebody else's. Second, you get to keep 100% of the sale instead of only earning a 50% commission or sometimes even less. As an affiliate promoting Amazon products, for example, you only get a 2% commission. 2%, that's ridiculous, right? And also with most affiliate offers, you will only get paid half, which means that it makes your profit margin much lower and it just becomes more difficult to make a profit, also in the long term as well. Three, you are in control of the product itself, meaning you can actually guarantee that the quality is good. That's the great thing that I love personally about selling my own products, just purely for the fact that I can control what I teach people, what people are learning from me, and that way I can ensure it actually works. Instead of, you know, if you're promoting an affiliate offer, what they have in the product is what they have in the product. And that's it, you can't change that in any way, shape or form. And sometimes it doesn't agree with what you believe yourself. So that's what I love about this as well. Also, when people buy a product from one person, they're five to 10 times more likely to buy from that same person again and again. Because if they've had a good experience with you, why wouldn't they wanna continue having more good experiences with future products? 
Makes sense, right? So that's why it's often common to see customers buy multiple things from you and increase their average order value. Next, you're branding yourself as the expert and not somebody else. As an affiliate, you're just kind of saying, hey, go and buy this person's stuff, which is positioning them as the expert and then somebody else and then somebody else. And before you know it, your word becomes worthless because you're just recommending all these different people and people see you as just some snake oil salesperson and suddenly your reputation goes down the toilet, which a much better approach of doing that is to sell your own stuff, position yourself as the expert, build your own brand, and that way nobody can take that away from you. Awesome, right? Next, you can actually build out a full product line, including low-priced to high-priced solutions, instead of creating a patchwork quilt of solutions which don't fit together correctly and harm your people. This is one of the biggest reasons why I stopped doing affiliate marketing about seven years ago now, purely for the fact that a lot of affiliate offers will contradict each other. One of them may say one thing and then you suddenly promote something different and then it suddenly contradicts what you said yesterday and your prospects are thinking, James, this is what you said yesterday, but now it's different. What is it? Which one is it, right? And you become that douchebag who's just, you know, seen to be extracting money from people no matter what the products are. So that's not a good position to be in. And that's one of the big downsides of being an affiliate and why it's often best to just sell your own stuff because you are, once again, in control of everything. And the final thing is you can get other people, affiliates, to sell your product for you. How awesome is that? So imagine as an affiliate, you are promoting somebody else's stuff. But what if you were that other person? What if you were the person that other people were promoting your products for, right? They were the ones making the sales for you. You sit back, free money. Awesome, right? So those are the many, many reasons why having your own products really beats being an affiliate. So there are more aha moments here. Yes, this does take a small amount of extra work up front, but it will enable you to reach over $100,000 per year a lot faster than simply being an affiliate and picking up the scraps that other affiliates leave behind. And that's another thing. As an affiliate, you're competing with thousands of other affiliates doing the exact same thing. Wouldn't it be better if you were the only person to have a unique solution because of the stuff you've learned in this inner circle? Makes sense, right? So, if you still want to incorporate affiliate marketing into your business, that is totally fine. You can still do that. You can still promote other people's offers and launches as an affiliate in your members area and at the end of your follow-up sequence too. So I'm not saying here you cannot be an affiliate, period. I'm saying that it's best to do affiliate marketing in the right places in your sales funnel to maximize your revenue and also the amount of value you provide to your audience and your customers, okay? Awesome. So here's my own experience. When I first started out in 2008, I was selling a product about building chicken coops as an affiliate because my niche research said that it was a profitable niche to go into. I had zero experience keeping chickens. I didn't want to learn how to keep chickens. Just what my research said was profitable at the time, okay? Then it took me a whole year to make my first affiliate commission selling this product. At that point, I shifted to creating my own product with a tiny amount of knowledge I'd acquired over the last year, which was nothing special, nothing groundbreaking, and I definitely wasn't anywhere near the kind of authority status that I have now, right? So I made my first thousand dollars in my first month after creating it. It was like a profit switch. This was the game changer that catapulted my business from making a sale here, a sale there, to making thousands upon thousands thousands of dollars per month, okay? Hopefully that's encouraging to you as well. Now, you may have some excuses here because a lot of people have reasons for not creating their own products, including one, I'm not an expert. And I hear this all the time from my clients. They say to me, James, I don't have the knowledge. I don't have the experience. I don't have a clue what I would put into a product. So I have zero idea what to do. But the reality is your average prospect is gonna know nothing, nothing whatsoever about your topic. So even if you do a bit of research, just a small amount of research to the point at which you know slightly more than they do, they're gonna find it valuable, right? And this could even be as simple as you know buying somebody else's course in your niche or looking at videos on YouTube or taking a class or something like that. Enhance your knowledge in that industry and that will elevate your status to above them and that's all they need. 
just somebody who is doing better than them. Second, taking forever to get it finished. And this is a big one. Again, a lot of people think it takes several months or even years to create a product. You can get this done in just a few days, all right? Third, it's a lot of work. Now, speaking from experience here, it does not take a lot of time to rebrand somebody else's product if you're using the resources we've included for you inside this Inner Circle program. It will take you just a few days. However, if you do want to put your own spin on things, if you want to create your own products from scratch, it will take you probably around two weeks. And that's even with a full-time job. We've had some clients do this in less than a week. So don't think it's gonna take you several months or several years, or it's gonna take you many, many hours. That's not the case. Yes, it will take you that long if you procrastinate it, if you just try and be perfect with every single little thing in it, and you're just constantly nitpicking at everything until it's perfect. Yes, it's gonna take that long. But if you do things correctly, it should not take you much effort at all. All right. Number four, I'm scared of getting negative comments. Now, this is often a problem for people who have self-confidence issues. They think of all of these imaginary situations in their head of what could happen. But realistically, anything could happen. Like the earth could implode tomorrow, touch wood, that you know your life is going to be over, right? Anything could happen. But the reality is that does not happen. You will not get a ton of negative comments from people. You will not get your family cast you out if they magically stumble upon your business or whatever. Often they're very supportive. Supportive. So do not worry about getting negative comments and even if you do, haters are going to hate and not everyone is going to like your stuff. But that is in a very small minority, alright? Next, not knowing how to do it. That's why you're in this Inner Circle program, to learn how to do it. And I'm going to show you the shortest way to get that done. So you need to ignore these limiting beliefs and just get started with it. Think of it this way. If you sit there just brewing over all of these negative thoughts and all of these excuses, they're just going to turn into something that's going to stop you from moving forward. The most important thing is just to take some kind of action moving forward. And then all of these doubts, all of these excuses disappear. Because you're taking action, you make this real. And when it's real, you will see none of this applies. All right? Let's go. So an alternative to all of this stuff is after all of this stuff, you still feel like you can't create your own products for a legitimate reason. For example, you're terrible on camera and don't want to learn. You have issues with speech. You have issues with writing and so on and so on. You can actually pay another expert to create them for you. Once again, you do not need to do everything yourself, okay? So this isn't as expensive as you think. It will cost you anywhere between $500 and $750 per product on average, which honestly is a steal, taking into account you're building an asset for your business, which is going to last you for the next five plus years. It's crazy, right? Most offline businesses have overheads of about $10,000 plus per month. And here you are creating your assets for 500 bucks. Pretty crazy. So for all of the product types in this section, yes, even premium consulting services, I will be coaching you to create them yourself, but also coaching you on how to get them created by an expert too. Welcome back. So hopefully you enjoyed this episode. If you did, don't forget to hit the like button if that feature is available to you and subscribe as well if you can. Also, don't forget to check out our website at digitalprosperity.com if you would like to know how we can help you to make your first $10,000 online with online courses and creating your own legacy instead of promoting somebody else's, taking on board everything you've just learned. Have a great day.